Hey planner peeps. So today I'm um, going to open this. I haven't for a while gotten anything from, well, from overseas anywhere where they're going to send it in a big container ship. Because <sighs> I feel bad for the whales, but I don't know, maybe I have a shopping problem. So I'm not going to flip this over because it has my address on it. But I was cutting it open. And so I think what they did is it's some kind of, oh um, man, do these all have my address on them? They do. Okay, so already I can say I feel sad by the amount of plastic and should we go like small, medium, large, or large, medium, small? This one feels like it has washi, so we're gonna, let's go small, medium, large. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of plastic, guys. All this is gonna end up in the sea. I don't know why I'm making my feel, myself feel bad, but okay, so. These are the individual washies, um, mushrooms, hearts, pine cones, fall like, more hearts, something I'm not sure, something I'm not sure. Okay, let's fast forward the opening so we can get to the fun part. Okay, just saying, all that plastic from four of these, and that doesn't count the, the middle, which I don't know. I hope it's paper, but I'm not entirely sure. So these are just, I think this is the beginning. Oh my. Um, but yeah, oh. Oh, you get a lot of these. So is that a mushroom? That doesn't really look like a mushroom. I guess this is supposed to be a mushroom from an angle where it's like super open. Oh my, oh there's, is there another one? Oh yeah, there's two here. Oh, so this is like an over ripe mushroom that you would not, well, you wouldn't eat any of these. These are, are they supposed to be fly agara? Like those are poisonous. Um, but that one's cute and they feel pretty sticky. Um, they're pretty opaque. Same with the pine cones. There's a lot of pine cones. Oh, is that an acorn? Pine cones, acorns. So those are fall. Maybe I'll just like leave them and surprise myself. Um, they're not going to dry out, not wrapped up, are they? I'm not sure, but I guess we'll find out. And then these are kind of spring light. Today is actually St. Patrick's Day and in Toronto it is 15 degrees higher in some parts apparently it's 17 in some areas but um i'm by the lake but um 15 degrees celsius is like super warm it is you don't need a coat like you need a jacket but nothing else no mittens for sure no gloves for sure so hmm these are like Varied. These are very sticky, but they do come apart. So they're kind of variated with uh, the blue. So they're not one color. So that's kind of interesting. And then, hmm, this one looks damaged. Let's bring this janky one off. Oh yeah, that's the beginning too. So I guess they just like punch these out and they just get rolled 
on. So, well, he's a little damaged, but it also has like a, a watercolor effect. These ones are more earth colors. I guess I should put that one back. Um, then, I don't know what this is, 30 pieces of something. Oh, I think it's paper? Is it? That's really pretty. Um, so that's pretty. They're just like vellum. I don't... <sighs> you know when you order something and you think it's something completely different? So these are just... And of course I don't have planner paper out. Always need planner paper. Always. Kind of big here, but oh man, that took a really long time. But those would fit in. Well, these are not landscape. These are a portrait size, but they would kind of fit there, kind of there. I mean, you could cut them down, kind of. So with some little fish friends. Uh, water lilies, white lotus, I don't know. So it looks like there's three of each. This one's like a, those butterflies. Boat builder's handbook, which is okay. Oh, orchids. Oh, that's pretty. But they're, um, well, they're vellum, they're see-through. That one's nice too, a little chickadee. Flower friends with butterflies. House of roses with a little goldfinch. Uh, I don't know what these birds are. I feel like I should. Some kind of warbler and a chickadee again, maybe? And then these guys, which you already saw. And these are already curling, if you can see that. So, super cute, questionable when, if, where I will use them. Okay, this is paper too, and I thought this was a totally different size, but, or maybe I didn't. It's not exact. It'll fit here though. Well, you'd have to take off a tiny bit. Well, there's stuff you could do with them. These are really, really thin, single-sided. Um, so you got those, those. So it looks like there's three or four of each. These ones you could cut into. Mm -hmm. You could cut all of these down. I think that's why I wanted these. They're fine paper, like thin paper, which is sometimes in Canada harder to find. Um, but they would cut down easy. They would glue into a planner easily without adding a lot of bulk. And then I don't know what these are other than hard to open. Okay, they look like they're all little squarey squares. Oh, they're little squares of kind of a shiny-ish paper with all different... Oh, so, I don't know. They were kind of stuck together, so I thought they were the same. Oh, I see. I don't see. 
the question that I always want to know. <gasps> Ooh, guys, what? Those will fit perfectly there. Perfectly. Okay. So these ones, goodbye. Like as in a good purchase, not in chow. Okay, so are these oranges or peaches? I think they're, or they're oranges, okay. Fun fact, I'm allergic to like every fruit. I can eat oranges though. But like a lot of other fruits, if they have a seed in them, I can't have them. Or sometimes I can have them and then sometimes I can't, depending on if they have seeds and like grapes. If I crunch the seed, that's awesome. Sorry, I hate sarcasm. I'm trying not to do it. I think it's like a pretty weak way of doing humor. This says squeeze the day. <laughs> oh, at least they're not peaches. I can't eat peaches. All those things with uh, pits I cannot have. Peaches, pears, plums, apples. Apples don't have pits, I'm aware of that, but um, all those things. I can have them if they're cooked a lot of the time. A lot, a lot of the time I can have them. Like, I love putting apple butter on uh, pork chops and I totally can, but it's like cooked to hack. Apple butter, not the pork chops. Okay, so that was the first one. Kind of feeling these. This one, not so much. This one, pretty like. These, I'll tell you in the fall. These, we'll play with soon. Which one is medium? This is medium. Is that all of it? Yeah, okay, medium. See, and this is a lot of, I don't wanna keep going on about it, but why is it so much plastic? Why? Why? Like, why does this have plastic on it? Oh, sorry. I feel like I'm like the planner who complains about everything. Okay. So, I thought this was black. And it's kind of cute, but I feel like it's I'm not a fan of blue and I feel like it's navy, but you get a lot. Okay, let's take a look at it. Oh, it's kind of a purpley gray. It's kind of cute. I don't know if it picks up, but in the background there's like, um, there's the same design sort of in a shadow that is printed in this rose gold. So actually I kind of like that. And then, man, this is vellum again. Okay, these I'm most excited about. So we're gonna look at these. So these are washi. They have a plastic back, which will end up in a whale's belly sometime. And there's like some little guys here, which are probably easier to see, not on my planner. So I guess that's Leo. So there's two different kinds. There's these ones, they're kind of stuck together. There's a lot of moons. There's like a boho moon, like a star, another boho moon, Gemini, Taurus. These guys have girls. Capricorn. Are these coming up? Capricorn. Uh, this is gonna be hard to see, I think. Uh, 
another star. I think that's the water for the water bearer. Saji. Can oh, it's another star. Cancer. Yeah, there's the water bearer. Uh, Scorpio, I guess. She's got a little scorpion there, or it's a lobster. Let's, it's a lot. It's a Scorpio. She's Scorpio. I just don't understand her hair. More, there's a lot of these little guys. Is that another, what is that? I don't know what that is, you guys. Is that supposed to be another Capricorn? Oh no, it's a fish with a moon. Uh, I don't know what that one is. Um... Looks like a girl about to be born, or I don't know. There's a uh, Libra, she's got the scales. There's another Leo, but this is a Leo without a girl. Oh, and there's Taurus with a girl, a woman riding. She kind of looks less defined than she looked, obviously, and that's. Did we see Aries? I guess that's Aries. Okay, let's see what we're dealing with here. Yeah, so it's a really thin washi. It looks like it would be... It's pretty opaque on paper. It's, ooh, pretty sticky too. Like, pretty sticky. And then there's these tarot card styles. So, oh, these ones actually say, so that's Aquarius, Aries. Yeah, that was Aries, that one we weren't sure about. Taurus, Cancer. I don't think we saw Cancer. Leo. Oh, that was Virgo. That one that was about to be born was Virgo. Um, Libra. Capricorn, Scorpio with her lobster. Oh, it's Pisces, but Pisces has dual. It's the fishes, not the mermaid girl. And Gemini. So I was in a. Sh I didn't realize yet these were washi. Washi. Um, I thought they would be more golden, but. Um, Oh, also I'm kind of looking at them under lights. They're pretty golden actually. Not in the light. They're like, I think the lighting is just really bad, but yeah, they're fine. Part of me doesn't even want to open these ones up. Oh, oh, interesting. Okay. These are not vellum. These are also washi tape stickers that would be translucent. And there's several. They all seem to be vertical. Oh, and there's some smaller sizes. They seem to mostly be vertical, but there's some that you could plonk. You can cut these really easily. You wouldn't even have to trim very much. The colors are very muted and antique though. But yeah, those could be made to fit really easily. Uh, butterfly friends, weird flowers. I mean, I guess really these are probably better in a junk journal where you just need a strip because there's all these other layers. But honestly, I don't, I mean, I have some journals. I could go back to journaling, but honestly, I don't know if I want to. It's like, not really my jam anymore. 
also do like that these were stickers. That was a kind of nice bonus. Super fun with that. These ones weren't stickers, were they? It says letters. But then do these even say sticker? No, these were curling. They're for sure not stickers. There's no backing. Plastic packaging. Oh. So it's like a little washi sticker book. But they're like weird little loops of stickers. So I guess the white is probably translucent. Oh, are they cut? Oh, they're cut. They're cut. Oh, interesting. I thought they were sheets. They're cut little, they're cut stickers. Oh, fun. Okay. These are probably more also better for a junk journal, but there's some fun ones. These are both two stickers, so two stickers per page. But like, they're fan happy planner dashboard or even if you wanted to, ooh, see, that's nice. That would fit down here really well. Oh, there's some like, oh, I think I remember that this is why I bought it for these ones and they will most likely fit down here. Not perfectly, but pretty perfectly. Like I think you could cover up, not edge to edge, but you could cover up line to line, almost. I think you could actually. That one kind of has a, that meal planner vibe. The tall ones, I don't really, I mean, you could do stuff with them if you're doing washi. Okay, that's kind of fun. That I'm not gonna put back in the plastic because, or maybe I should. Putting it back in the plastic for now. For now, it will remain out of the belly of the whale. Okay, last one, large. Oh dear. Okay. Oh, I do remember what these are. So these are, there's an artist that did flower fairies and then they took the flower fairies. I don't know if this is um, maybe illegal, I guess, but they somehow repented the flower fairies. So they, they put them into different, um, well, they come in a kind of cute container, but they, they have them divided up by color in color schemes. So these are, I can't remember her name, but I remember having the books when I was little and these little flower fairies were on everything. Although, I mean, they're clear, they're fun. You could put them, they would fit nicely. The quality isn't super crisp, but, um, Oh, these are cute. I wish I could remember what all the fairies were. So she painted these or drew them like with the flower that they lived on. I don't know if these are actually her. I think these are just extra ones. Like, I don't know if these are from her books or not. They look, maybe they are, but like, See, I don't know fa enough flowers. Well, that's a, a daffodil. So that's a daffodil fairy. 
I don't know what this is, although I feel like I should know that leaf. This has a little bird, but no fairy friends. It looks like there's three of each. It's another daffodil. Oh, uh, what's his? You can kind of also see the leaves. Fewer, better. Oh yeah, see their little outfits are made of the kind of uh, fairy they are, so, or like the flower of the fairy that they are. That looks like an iris, but it's probably not an, is it an iris yellow. Is it a crocus? I don't know what that is. So these ones are fun. I like that the box that they come in is paper. Okay, so I think this is a pink or a green theme. Um, there's her, some little moths. Well, that's a clover, isn't it? I don't know what he is, although some of these are familiar, like I should know them. And then there's a lot of flowers. I remember when I was a kid, these designs were on all kinds of things like little pocket mirrors. Uh, I think I have a pin that has a specific, that's a strawberry fairy, but I think maybe in there I saw her. It was a clover fairy, but not this one, I don't think. No, I'm sure it wasn't her. So maybe it wasn't a clover. I assumed it was, but I think this was the green theme. Okay, so these I will really want to use soon. That's weird that I got blue. I'm not a fan of blue. Oh, they're purple. Oh, I know why, because I think that fairy is in here. That's a him. That's a, is that a hyacinth? That's a cute fairy. Did anybody, um, there was, it was a comedy book, like it was meant to be, it was satire, it was funny. But there was, and I don't know if it was sort of satirical about these fairies, but it was a pressed fairy book, and it was basically drawings of fairies that had been squished in between <laughs> the pages of someone's book. And there's a blackberry fairy. She's kind of cool, or he. Yeah, I thought there was a fairy in here. Oh well. Um, but anyway, so it was like these squished fairies. And every time I would see the, um, the press foils by Happy Planner, I would just think of these, the squished fairy book. And it would be awesome if they're, that's cotton, I think. Nope, that's a pussy willow. Um, it would be awesome if there were squished fairy stickers, but that's a much newer book. I think these are quite old, her drawings. Um, and also just, I did a lot of um, pressing flowers when I was younger. I had lots of flower presses. I never pressed a flower that looked as janky as those stickers they put out. Like maybe they were intentionally supposed to look super squished like hey look at what I did in my flower press first time ever but um wasn't a fan so these don't fit exactly they'll fit from here to the line oh they're all different so 
these. So I must have picked a whole bunch of different themes, but this seems to be water, moons, moons. I couldn't remember what the name of that show is with the train, the Korean director, man. Oh, that stupid train again. So those are, do I need to put these back in the, I'm gonna consider not. I don't wanna keep more plastic around, but also, anyways, the pile of plastic that's growing here is ridiculous. Oh, Lammy. That's a street car. Uh, so then the, oh, that's interesting. These have um, more of a, more of a sort of a, like a misty, like that one looks like a Snapchat photo with lambs. This cat looks like it just sneezed, but also it has fairy wings. Oh, this is kind of interesting. Some of these are boring and some of these are really weird. Like that's just a green phone. Oh, I guess this is a green theme here now we've gotten into. Okay, is that marshmallows? We're eating marshmallows? Not really sure. Oh yeah, this is just like all green theme. Okay, so were these green and, oh, so I wasn't getting the theme, you guys. It's green, duh. The theme is green. So then I'm guessing this is, they all say sunset, romantic, wonderful time. And then I can't read what it says. Santa Monica, okay, so this is pink. This way, it's the same, they'll fit line to line, but not to the bottom break. And this way, they'll fit line to line, but also the break is. So I'm assuming these are like washi as well. I mean, you could put them over here, but I think they're gonna do better over here. Ooh, pokey. Okay, so that was, and then I guess this is yellow, which makes sense. Yellow is also one of my favorite colors. That's a peach, which I'm allergic to. That's goldenrod, I don't know. Weird shadow picture. Go solo, it's... Uh, this is an interesting selection. Okay, that's inter interesting because she's surrounded by daffodils, but no, her dress has roses. Roses, that's a cool picture. Okay. Uh, some of these would be cooler if they were bigger, but you make me happy. Ginkgo leaves. Okay, so these are fun. And then last thing, I think these are sticky notes. Oh my God, the amount of plastic, you guys. So, huh. let's see how sticky they are. Yeah, they're not very sticky but it's about what I expected. 
this one you could write on. The other ones you would have to have like a, a light colored gel pen. Let's see how well you can write on them. Yeah. You can erase. I'm like one of the, I normally don't erase them. I normally use my sticky notes. And then when they have writing on them, because I use the friction, I just put them in the microwave to get rid of the stickiness. But diffuse down, don't miss your scenery expires never actually that's pretty classic it expires never color number zero okay so that's it this isn't even all of the plastic but just saying like plus these three plus this is it worth it there's also plastic in a lot of this stuff in the coverings. These fairy stickers are plastic. Anyways, uh, yeah. Fun though, I like a lot of this stuff. I'm excited to use it in, uh, in my planner. But uh, thanks for watching me complain about what's gonna end up in a whale's belly. I hope you enjoyed and I will talk to you soon. Hopefully. Take care.